In this problem, we have in the binomial expansion of 1 plus x to the n, where n is greater than or equal to 4, the coefficient of x to the 5 is 2 times the coefficient of x to the 4. Find the value of n. OK, now, when you've got 1 plus x to the n, you know that each term of the binomial expansion will be of the form of having three parts, where this is 1 to the power of something. This is going to be x to the power of something. And what you've got here is your ncr. OK? So ncr. And so this is r. This could be n minus r. OK? So then, um, if the coefficient of x to the 5, so we want the coefficient of x to the 5 here, so r would have to be 5. And so this would be n choose 5. That would be the coefficient of x to the 5, because that's just going to be 1, isn't it? OK, so the coefficient of x to the 5 is n choose 5. And that is 2 times the coefficient of x to the 4, which would just be n choose 4. OK, so this is the equation I now have. So we've got n c5, so n factorial over 5 factorial, n take away 5 factorial, is equal to 2 times n factorial over 4 factorial, n minus 4 factorial. This is the equation I need to solve. OK? So what I'm going to first of all do is divide both sides by n factorial. And I'm going to simplify the 5 factorial and the 2 over 4 factorial. So 5 factorial is 120. So we've got 1 over 120, n take away 5 factorial is equal to, then we've got 2 divided by 4 factorial is 1 over 12. So 1 over 12, n take away 4 factorial. Now, just as we did in the previous video, to solve this equation, I'm going to multiply both sides by the larger of the two factorials, so n take away 4 factorial. So we're going to get n take away 4 factorial, multiplying both sides by that, over 120, n take away 5 factorial is equal to 1 over 12. OK, so n take away 4 factorial is n take away 4, times n take away 5, times n take away 6, all the way down to 1. So that's n take away 4 times n take away 5 factorial. So now I can cancel the n take away 5 factorial top and bottom of that fraction. So solving that, I'm going to be left with n take away 4 over 120 is equal to 1 over 12. So then multiply both sides by the 120. So n take away 4 is equal to 10. And then add 4 to both sides. So n would have to be equal to 14. And that solves the problem.